The arrival of Agriculture Minister Umar Jalo in Foni Bondali Tenda was marked by a big gathering that accorded the agrarian community an opportunity to communicate their main constraints to the delegation. Like other communities, villagers here lamented the need for stronger interventions by the ministry to improve the agriculture sector. Bondali is one beneficiary of a major agricultural scheme. The NEMA project is supporting the village from saltwater intrusion, creating more land and space for farmers to produce rice. In his remarks, the agriculture minister assured the community of government's commitment to transform the agriculture sector. He promised that his ministry will promote areas such as agriculture, poultry production and small ruminant rearing. He said his ministry will provide villages with fishing boats to promote fisheries in the area. Minister Jalo called on the Bondali community to remain patriotic and to strive hard towards national development. The Minister of Agriculture and the government has to be very mindful of the importance of agricultural production in Gambia. We have seen that agricultural production has fallen down drastically in the last 22 years. And it becomes so much frustrating that 75% of the youths that have gone the back way are all from the rural areas. That has never happened before. From Bondali, the delegation proceeded to the Jefanga village garden supported by GCAF, a project on the agriculture. The garden, as Ami Fabure explained, is meant to boost the capacities of women farmers in horticultural production. Here, villagers thank GCAF and the Ministry of Agriculture for initiating a vital intervention. From Jifanga, the tour parties continued to the village of Demban, where Agriculture Minister Umar Jalo officially opened a market constructed by the NEMA project. In a strategic location, the market is expected to attract and soar up business and trading activities in the Foni region. The NEMA scheme is also looking to ease mobility constraints for sellers and buyers. But there is a lot of areas in agriculture which need to be strengthened and improved because some of our directorates, some of the institutions that are in the rural areas are not functional because they lack a lot of things. So my coming here is important that we are going to make a report now to government and see how best we can improve on it so that agriculture will effectively make sure it takes its rightful place in the social economic development of this country. In a meeting with the community, the man in charge of the most vital sector in the Gambia outlined a focus agenda to revitalize and boost the food and crop production. He described as an unyielding drive to transform a sector that suffered 22 years of slow-moving growth and underdevelopment. Reporting for DRCS News, I am Famarakani.